Since 1854, the St Vincent de Paul Society in Australia has been providing practical and personal support to people in need. 60,000 members, volunteers and staff are active at the coalface in over 1,000 local communities around the country. Australia faces uncertain times. The coronavirus pandemic will have an impact on how we live our lives for years to come. We have seen an increase in catastrophic fires, drought and flood and economic conditions have never been more uncertain. Right now, our services are in high demand, often by people who have not called on our support before. While Vinnie's is one of Australia's most effective and respected charities, we need to be vigilant as we respond to emerging need. As part of its ongoing governance responsibilities, the National Council has reviewed the way we do things and how we measure our success. Today, I would like to talk to you about our three-year strategic plan, which was released in August 2020. The plan represents a watershed moment in our history. It clearly sets out the roles and functions of the National Council and the ways in which National Council works with our state and territory councils. Across five strategic goals and six long-term objectives, the plan sets out a blueprint for the society for the next 10 years. Importantly, National Council has determined measures to gauge our success. This strategic plan informs our approach to spirituality and membership, ensuring all our volunteers, members and companions are welcomed, valued and supported. It informs our approach to advocating and influencing the national agenda through high-level research and high-level engagement with decision makers around the country. It also informs our approach to governance and leadership so that here at home, our culture, management and service standards are second to none and internationally, we play our part in growing the society's effectiveness worldwide. For the first time, it articulates how, as a National Council, we will work with our state and territory counterparts. And it outlines our approach to the sustainability of our finances and resources to ensure that we are well placed to continue our essential work. You'll find a copy at vinnies.org.au. The National Council's plan will bring about a stronger, more integrated society that as we enter what might well be the most difficult decades Australia has ever seen, positions us well to meet the new and uncertain challenges that lie ahead.